get on the radio. You tell the follow teams to cordon off this entire area. I don't want anybody coming down here except the bomb squad and forensics. Follow teams cordon off two block for every ground six. No, block, block, block. Bauer. Hello, Jack. Oh, I knew you were better than Amador, but you're not better than me. Amador said you knew me. Who is this? First things first, Jack. There are... 11 other vials, each containing the same amount of virus that was released at the hotel. I'll use them the moment my instructions aren't followed. What do you want, money? I need you to put me in touch with a friend of yours. Oh, my God. Sir, I need Phillips. We're here, we need help. will be okay. They're lying to us. There's something wrong inside the building. It's inside the building! <laughs> Sir, calm down! Everyone, out of my way! Hold it right there! Step away from the window! I said step away from the window! If you try to leave, I will shoot you. President. The man in possession of the Cordilla virus has demanded to speak with you. We don't have a name on him yet, sir, but I do believe that if you don't speak with him, he'll release more of the virus. Unfortunately, Mr. President, right now at this time, I think you're going to have to give in to his demands. I'll speak to him. Yes, sir, I'll connect you. You are now on with the President. I'll make this brief. As you are no doubt aware, I am in possession of enough of the virus to decimate a good portion of the population of this country. And as I've shown at the Chandler Plaza Hotel, I will do so. Unless you follow the instructions you'll be receiving over the next few hours. Do you understand, Mr. President? I'm listening. You are no longer in control of your country. And if you do not use the full power of your office to execute my wishes, the virus will be released and it will be impossible to stop. You'll be hearing from me.